Hey guys, welcome back. So today we're dealing with basically just another algebra problem. Um, the key thing you need to do in this problem is remember that with fractions, you need to have a common denominator. So the easiest way um, that I find to do that is to multiply each term by the stuff it's missing. So I know that doesn't fully make sense the way I said it, but essentially um, you have to find the least common multiple and in that case, that is gonna be x minus three times x plus three. So if you FOIL that out, you're gonna get x squared. Oops, sorry, that should be a minus. Uh, let me erase that, sorry. You're gonna get x squared minus nine. I kind of skip steps, but if you wanna pause the video, go for it, And but that that's gonna be the answer. So um, that being said, you can, um, you can multiply each term by the least common multiple, but in the end, you're actually going to end up doing more work because you're going to have to cancel a bunch of stuff out. So the way I like to do this is I just see that um, this left-hand term over here is missing an x plus 3 term. So I multiply the numerator and the denominator by x plus 3. Okay, so over here, I notice that the denominator is missing an x minus 3 term. So I multiply the numerator and the denominator by x minus 3. So now what you can see I did is I essentially created a common denominator for both of the fractions, which is equal to this right here. So now that we have the same denominators, we can go ahead and add the numerators. So I'm going to go ahead and multiply this 3 through. So I'm going to get 3x plus 9. And then over here, I'm going to multiply this x through. So I'm going to get x squared minus 3x. And this is all over. Um, I'll keep it like this. x plus 3 times x minus 3. Now all I can do is simplify the numerator. So we have a 3x and a minus 3x, which is going to be 0. So now we have x squared plus 9 over. Um, I'm now going to write this in the multiplied out form, which is x squared minus 9. And from there, that is pretty much all we can do. So this here is your answer. All right, thanks for watching. My email is in the description if you have any questions.